Greeny, two goals in a 5-0 win tonight. Just how much did you enjoy that one? Yeah, I loved it. Um, obviously, because a couple of problems in the first half, they were hard to break down. But um, we, we moved the ball really quick and then we, we took his chance when it came. It felt like the times that you got your goal, obviously being the first two and the, the one coming just before half-time, it sort of gave us a platform to build off. How important do you feel them goals were in the, in the overall scheme of the game? Yeah, it's always nice to, to go in with a, a goals lead. Um, I think it was about 38 minutes, but they were a team to break down and, and we kept doing the right things. We kept moving the ball quick. We, we kept interchanging and finally we broke the deadlock and it's something that we deserved anyway because I think we were just a constant threat going forward. Um, very rarely did they have much possession and I think it was a dominant performance from start to finish. Like you mentioned there, they were a hard team to break down and it did take us nearly 40 minutes. But once we got that, it sort of felt like we went on and, and really put the game to bed. How impressed were you after we got that first goal with the attacking performance? Yeah, I mean, they had to change the game plan. Um, obviously, with with us scoring um, late on in the, the first half and early in the second half, they had to come out and that, that changed their out, outcome and how they wanted to play and they were a lot of gaps for us to get on the ball and, and slide as wide players in and, and, and create chances and that's what we did and that's why we scored three, four, five in the end. It's three goals in a week for yourself now following your goal last week. Just how much are you enjoying this little run of form? Yeah, it's brilliant. Um, obviously, uh, at a tender age of 40, it's, it's great to be out there and I'm still loving my football and you can see uh, the energy that I bring to the team and obviously chipping in with a few goals, it's it, it's good and uh, like I say, I'm, I'm really enjoying my football at this moment in time and may it long continue. Three goals for yourself this week and 16 for the team. Just how good is it to be able to play in a team that's free scoring like that? I mean, I know when I, when I signed, uh, obviously last year, um, and then had to leave, and but to come back with the same players and probably added a couple of quality players as well. We knew what we we can produce, and um, the players that we've got in this team uh, shows we can score goals. After that game at Stockport, we've had three home games now this week, and we've picked up maximum points. Just how impressive is it with the run that we're we're building at home this season? Home farms massive for us. Um, the way we play, uh, we make way we move the ball. Um, how zippy it is out there. You can see what kind of football we're, we're playing and uh, deservingly to be in second place uh, tonight and say a big game on Saturday and um, it's going to be tough. We know it's going to be tough. I think they're third or fourth, wherever they are in the league. So they're going to be there for a reason. So we've got to be on his game. Like you mentioned there, Warrington, third in the league, leapfrogged them tonight. And it's a, it feels like a big game on Saturday. How much are you looking forward to the challenge that they'll pose? That's it. It's the, the big games that you want to play in, and um, no more so than the teams around us. So um, it's going to be a tough test. We know that uh, away from home. We know they're going to be trying to get in the ascendancy, uh, being the home team. But I'm sure we'll go there with a game plan and, and give it us all, and hopefully get the three points.